Did you know that over 2,000 reported sightings of the Jersey Devil have been documented since the 1700s? That's right. This legendary creature has captured the imaginations of many, leaving a trail of fascination and fear. From eyewitness accounts to detailed reports in local newspapers, the Jersey Devil story is one that refuses to fade. So what's the deal with the Jersey Devil? Let's dive in. Welcome back to Arcana Axis. Today we're exploring the eerie world of the Jersey Devil, a creature steeped in folklore and mystery. Originating from the dense woods of the Pine Barrens in New Jersey, this mythical being has become a symbol of local culture and superstition. From its chilling description, a creature with bat-like wings, hooves, and glowing red eyes, to its role in community lore, the Jersey Devil is a story that continues to haunt and intrigue. Now here's where things get interesting. The existence of the Jersey Devil has sparked an ongoing debate. Some dismiss it as a mere myth, while others argue it's real. Believers point to numerous accounts and sightings over the centuries, but what does this creature represent in our folklore? Let's take a deeper look into the history of the Jersey Devil. From the earliest sightings in the 1700s to more recent reports, there's no shortage of haunting tales. The legend began with the Leeds family in the Pine Barrens. Mother Leeds cursed her 13th child, who was born as a monstrous creature and fled into the woods. In 1909, the most famous wave of sightings occurred. Over a week, there were more than a thousand reports across New Jersey and Pennsylvania. People claimed to see the creature attacking trolleys, leaving strange tracks, and being shot at by law enforcement. The Philadelphia Zoo even offered a $10,000 reward for its capture. These stories have woven themselves into New Jersey culture, keeping the mystery alive. Now, let's shine a spotlight on one compelling sighting. In 1960, a group of teenagers claimed they saw the Jersey Devil while camping in the Pine Barrens. They described a creature, tall with wings and a terrifying scream. They even managed to capture a blurry photo, which sparked heated discussions online and in local communities. When we think about the Jersey Devil, it's interesting to compare it to other legendary creatures like the Mothman of West Virginia or the Chupacabra of Latin American folklore. These creatures are rooted in specific regions and their stories are passed down through generations, becoming part of the local identity. The Jersey Devil stands out due to its deep historical roots, dating back to colonial America. So what have we learned about the Jersey Devil? Whether you view it as a spooky myth or a real creature lurking in the shadows, its story is undeniably fascinating. From its cultural significance in New Jersey to the countless sightings and legends, the mystery of the Jersey Devil continues to captivate us today. What do you think? Is the Jersey Devil real or just a figment of our imagination? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this exploration of folklore, make sure to check out our next video, where we dive into other mysterious creatures and legends from around the world. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more spooky content. See you next time.